What's going on everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to be doing Instacart and Uber Eats. It has been extremely slow. This week has not been that great. Um, I'm thankful for the numbers that I was able to hit, but for the amount of hours I was out, it was just not worth it. But it is what it is. You're gonna have your good and your bad days. So hopefully Instacart and Uber Eats treats us good today. So let's run it up today, let's go. All right guys, so I just pulled up to the store right now. It's 8.15. I am outside of Stater Brothers. I'm not sure if you can see that. And behind me, I am outside of McDonald's. So I got Stater Brothers, McDonald's. Um, I like this parking lot for Uber Eats and, and uh, uh, Instacart because um, if I get a McDonald's order, I'm still within the circle. So I can still get orders for, uh, for Stater Brothers. But the thing is for me, there is better restaurants to be waiting at, but my priority is Instacart and Uber Eats is like a, a, the secondary thing, right? So I know everybody out there understands what I'm saying is you, you, you prioritize one more than the other because one typically is better than the other, right? So uh, for me, Instacart is better even though it has been sucky lately and Uber Eats is a secondary thing. And sometimes Uber Eats is pretty good, but uh, I think the most I've made in one day getting orders back to back was 80, $83. So my priority is instacart so i like this parking lot for me to do both both apps so 8 15 i'll let you guys know if i get anything I'll, I'll even show you guys the orders that i see all right i'm gonna screenshot everything i'm gonna let you guys know how bad i've been having it lately now hopefully hopefully i just jinx myself and have a, a, a really good day but uh yeah so i'll let you guys know the orders i see and the orders that i'm gonna get so let's go let's run it up baby let's go all right guys so it is now 908 uh i haven't hit my hour yet so i guess i don't qualify for for a real order um so i have seen nothing but crap so far let's see here well just got out tapped on a 25 you know i just got out tapped on a 45 so that's fucking fantastic <clears throat> yeah anyways jesus christ I seen a 26 for Lowe's going 18 miles, $29 sprouts for two in uh, like three cities over. A crappy 26 for two, a crappy $8 order. I guess it wasn't terrible because it was only going 0 0.7 miles, but I'm not gonna do that. A 22 for three, that's garbage. A 15 for one for the other store. 17 for one for sprouts for 36 items. Nope, and I took a $7 I took a $7 McDonald's. Uh, there's a $13 for the other store that's crap. And yeah. And I got out tapped on a 45. So that, that sucks. It really does. So yeah, guys, $7 McDonald's. Today is already going down the wrong path. If I got that 45, then we're in business. But it is what it is. What can you do? Can't cry about it. I guess you can cry about it, but it's not going to change the outcome. So $7 McDonald's. Let's go. All right, guys, so it is now 1022 and I have still made nothing on Instacart. Um, I'm only at seven dollars on Uber Eats and I just got an eight dollar going uh, an eight dollar McDonald's going one point seven miles. It is what it is. I see other Instacart shoppers. They're getting orders. Uh, I talked to a few of them. They're uh, telling me the orders that they're seeing. I'm not even seeing them. It is what it is. This is nothing new. I'm not surprised. Um, yeah. So this is the reality of Instacart. You're going to have days like this. And sometimes you're just going to get treated like dog shit. And it's all good. It is what it is. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and grab this McDonald's order. And hopefully I don't get out tapped on anything else today. Because I got out tapped on a 45. And as far as like, that was the only thing worth taking that I've seen so far today. So. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this McDonald's and hopefully get something good, so let's go. All right, guys, so unfortunately, I'm just seeing all crap on Instacart. I've only done two Uber Eats orders. It's 11.45, so at 12.15, I'll be out for four hours, and yeah, today's just not it. Uh, there's other Instacart shoppers that are, that are seeing some orders. Um, they're not great, but they're still orders. 
not seeing anything um, that's worth grabbing, so I'm not gonna grab it. I'm not gonna stoop down to Instacart's level and have me play their game. You're gonna have days where you're getting orders. Boom, boom, boom. You're gonna have uh, days where you don't get orders. Now, the most important thing is to go to stores that you know, you know the stores are good. And if you've been doing Instacart for more than two weeks, you know what I'm talking about. You'll know the stores that are good. You know the stores that you, you can kill it at. And this is the new norm, guys. Instacart is not great anymore. I have been applying for jobs. Um, one job for Edison, actually, and I'm hoping to get that. Uh, I'll still be doing content and, and uh, on my days off and, and so I can continue my YouTube channel. But Instacart is just making me a depressed sack of you know what. It's just like stupid. There's no explanation for it. Uh, I'm at five stars. Like that even matters. Um, it's all luck. It's all luck. And sometimes luck's not on your side and it is what it is. But I'm not giving up yet, even though I probably should. Um, I'm going to drive down, uh, to the other Stater brothers, like three miles away and see if I can get any luck down there. Probably give it another hour, maybe two hour wait. But once it turns into a five to six hour wait, there's really no, no hope. You should just go home at that point, wave the white flag and just go home. But, uh, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and, uh, drive down the street and hopefully, Hopefully get something going because uh, usually the mornings are on the slower side. I come out just to start racking up the active hours and I'll take a 9 and a 15 and all that. But I'm not taking a 22 for 3. I'm not taking a 17 for 2. I'm not taking uh, an $8 order. You know, and I am a little picky, of course, but I'm not taking a $22 order for three customers. That's just pathetic. That's, that's like taking three $8 orders. Like, I'm not doing that. That's stupid. Um... So yeah, I'll let you guys know if I finally get something. I hope I do. I hope I make an epic ass comeback. I hope I make a comeback. Let's let's see if I can do it. I'm not trying to give up. I'm not trying to go home. Uh, yesterday I had a day of $48. 40, it was like $49. I did one order. I was out for seven hours. It's not pretty, not pretty. So uh, let's go. I hope you guys are killing it out there. I wish I was killing it. And uh, yeah, let's go. <clears throat> All right, guys. So uh, <clears throat> it's 1:25, and I have still not done an Instacart order. Um, I have seen a bunch of crap, like 25s for two high items, uh, a couple of double store orders, like not even, not even in the 30s. Um, it is what it is. I've waited over five hours and I'm, I've made a total of $15 on Uber Eats. It's not the market that I'm in. I'll tell you that I'm getting screwed over today and it happens. My one of my friends, I'm actually on the phone with him right now. He's going to be over 150. Um, he came out at nine. He's going to be at 150. Um, got some good ones. What can you do? If you're not being shown orders that are worth your time, what are you gonna do? You can't force it by taking $8 orders. The only good order that I've seen today was a 45 for two. For 45 for two that I got out tapped on, that was it. So uh, I'm gonna give it a few more minutes. So yeah, anyways. Um, uh, you can't force the issue. Obviously, I've I've uh, definitely put in my time out here, and nothing seems to be working for me today. Yesterday was just as bad. I was I only made forty eight dollars on Instacart. Um, but yeah, there's always tomorrow. Don't overreact to days like this. Of course, I'm pissed off. I'm pissed off. I want to work. I want to I want to make money. Some days you're gonna get treated good. Some days you're gonna get treated bad. And I'm just gonna, I might come back out later tonight and focus on Uber Eats, but I've made $48 on Instacart in two days. I waited for over four hours yesterday after that 48 and it rolled over in today, into today. And so it is what it is. If you guys are having it just as bad as I am, 
just understand that there's gonna be days like this. It's gonna suck. It's not, it's not always gonna be pretty. And start applying for jobs because it's not, it's only gonna get worse. It's not gonna get better. So it's, you might have some good days, but at the end of the day, this, this is not worth doing anymore, honestly. Uh, I have been applying for jobs. I think I mentioned that earlier. Um, I've been applying for jobs. I plan on doing Instacart part time again, like I, I like I originally did when I first started doing Instacart. It's just not good. If, it's not really that great doing it full time anymore. I'd rather have a steady uh, a, st a steady salary and then do this as I please. And if it just it sucks, it just sucks, and I can just go home. That type of thing. Uh, I'm really interested to know how you guys are doing as far as uh, Instacart today. Uh, man, it just, I just, I'm just so, I just can't go home. I just, I want to go home so bad, obviously, because it sucks, but I, I want to make money. You know, it's like, it sucks. But guys, um, it's all good. Start applying for jobs. Make sure you have your resumes uh, uh, up to date. Apply for some good jobs, even if they're, even if you don't think you qualify for them, just try. You never know. The worst thing that can happen is they say no, right? So just apply for them. I applied for a few, and I would just want to get a full time job, work eight hours, and then I'm down to work an eight hour job and then go do Instacart for two to four hours a day. I'm totally down for that, and I'm down to do Instacart on my my days off because I have so many hours of downtime each and every day and that all adds up and i'm like why am i out here for 70 to 80 hours and i'm only actually working for about 35 to 40 it's so pathetic it sucks uh i see people in the store working on orders it's not my it's not the market that i'm in trust me it's not the market that i'm in there's some good orders i'm just getting blocked so, so to speak um it is what it is but anyways guys i'm gonna go ahead and, and end this video here uh, I'll, I'll, I'm surprised if anybody made it this far through the video, but hey, it happens. It happens in this industry. So if you guys made it this far through the video, if you can give me a thumbs up for my uh, suffering, my pain and suffering. And if you guys could subscribe to the channel if you're new and click that notification bell. And until next time, guys, I'm out. Peace.